Anyway, let's enter Pandemonium Animix. <laughs> I keep seeing how uh, captions render that. <laughs> enter world. I'll have to actually put a stream margin here to be helpful later on. Thank you. I'm saying thank you to myself. Okay, so let's look at what we're looking at. Um, new season. 10, 2.7, Mr. Pandera Remix. Earn account rewards. Collect bronze to earn mounts, pets, and transmogs. Get started. Create a timer and already did that. Mr. Pandaria Remix, close. You have unspent talent points. Fresh scales, 15. Oh, I'm getting all my... All my achievements. <laughs> well, good. There's one very important... Th ah, poison. Oh god, all my stuff! <laughs> all my stuff is all over the place! I'm gonna need a few moments. Um, oh no, I need to do some other important stuff. I need to put my title on. Now... I do know from the PTR that you, once you're high enough level... You can put the Legend of Pandaria title on, but ah. not at this level. So, which is very frustrating. So for now, we're going to put Agent of the Black Prince because it's going to amuse the hell out of me. And yeah. because of what we're going to do next. So, what is actually going on here? So he turned us in the infinites. They're friends now. Um, I have gone to Pandaria. They will tell you. Um, I should just speak to her, and then we will, she will tell us what's going on. But anyway, we are, by the way, on the Timeless Isle, which should make complete sense under the circumstances. I would try to explain what the Timeless Isle is. Hmm? But as soon as you start thinking too hard about it, it, gets, it, it hurts. <laughs> but let's just say it is a region that drifts in and out of our reality that's always in the same time. And it's near Pandaria. That's all I, I know. And I've never quite understood it. Um, other than the sun stays in the same spot the whole time. The one thing that always trips me up is I've been to the Timeless Isle a lot of times over the years. The same people are there that were there during this event area. And my character keeps coming back at different times. And it's like... Causing some kind of paradox. Because he does oh adjust God, to size. Adorable. He does adjust to size, but unfortunately does not oh take my... passengers. So. Gosh, that is adorable. <laughs> so cute. They removed though. They only the Awu uh, Wu only shows up at the start. It used to be his only special. I want it back. Aww. I like the leapy prancy. I want to keep that, but I want oh woo -woo yes. back. I'm um, I am sad that I cannot pet Taiwan because I, I feel like I should I should be able to pet him. Well, that's very easy. <laughs> Let oh me get out God, of the way of other people. Hilarious. There, you can pet that Taiwan. And now it is the proper, slightly smaller, but yeah. I did see, I did see, and people come over, of course, because like, I got to pet Tyvon. Yep. <laughs> yep. Yeah. You have to pet Tyvon. That's not, that's like, that's the rule. See, look, it's like. Yeah. He's a pet magnet. Yes. He, um, oh my gosh. I so. I just <laughs> under him. Like, but I'm I'm so glad Tyvon's the proper size now. Uh, but I did see a Torin on one, and it was even bigger. It oh, was the best. 
yes. scale for size. That's really cool. I didn't know it would do that. But apparently, this is his right. So that makes me happy. But anyway, let's see. Mounts, more mounts. We need more, more valuable mounts. Um, I hate the default coloration of the Cliffside Wilder Drake, though. But I know I can fix that sometime very, very soon. Um, and then we'll pick a mount that can do both. Actually, let me get my Sandstone Drake out. And I'll move Tyvon to other mount. There, we're good. Alright. So let's actually do stuff. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Transmog. I got a transmog. Oh, no, I don't think I can transmog. You can. You can, but I don't think from the mount. Yes, you can. I did it earlier today. You most certainly can. Yeah, that's going on my bar. I know there's no cost. Shop, browse. All right, let's let's deal with something now. <laughs> that capital was amazing. I know exactly. Hold on, I'm not done yet. Um. No headpiece. Invite you to a group. Okay, hello. <laughs> I was like, get away from me! Alright. So... Uh... I forget... What was I called? Shadowblade. <laughs> daggers need a fix. We know what daggers we're using. It's weird, though, how you mog these. Like, you have to... It's alphabetical. Really? What's the point of making it favorite? Sleeper. Alright, are you gonna take? I think I had tried to put on the, um the cloak, but it wouldn't let me. Because you do get a cloak, and then, like, it has, it has a shield. Yeah. So let's see if that took, because no... I mean, yeah. I am currently transmog, so I know it works. Alright, so. She's got her daggers. She's got her... She's got her rogue... Oh, she's missing a very important piece. Hold on. She just always oh, looks so angry. Yeah. Oh, can I not do the headpiece? Hmm? I don't think I can do the head. Oh, that's weird. Is it because she's not wearing one currently? I think because she doesn't have... She, yeah, she doesn't have head on yet. Yeah. Also, her daggers... Did they... Beware of Yeti. So, when she gets her headpiece, which I think she gets actually soon, um... Mm -hmm. Her daggers are poisoned. Okay, that's the important part. Um, I do have a week or her telling me when it's not. So, I don't know how much you've explored yet. And notice what's um, different. I've done all of these, like, like the intro. I've gotten... Because I did it on the PTR, and I just ran around with a uh, Dark Iron Paladin a little earlier today. So... Okay, so you did in the PT. Well, I mean, in terms of, you notice, money doesn't matter? Correct. So, I had a lot of people complaining, like, well, what am I going to do with those specs? And, like, you don't, you destroy stuff you don't need anymore. It's very much, think of Diablo, if yeah. you ever play Diablo, of, like, junking your stuff you don't need anymore. It's very much that. Yeah. Um, you will get gems for abilities you don't have. I had the un I had the uncanny luck of getting rogue abilities. <laughs> and I was like, I don't need stuff that I have skills for already. But we'll see what happens. 
I don't need an extra vanish. It's on the same cooldown. Mean, mean you get to? Oh, I don't think you get to. Change is All good. right, let's start this. Um, we have much to learn from the past. It's about time. <laughs> um, why is the infinite dragonfly here? When the storm was show me that my sister's death was her choice, her sacrifice, it made me question the rest of the true timeline. What other moments of sorrow and anger had life saving had life saving consequences? When the Missa Pandaria parted, the Horde and the Alliance brought their conflict to these shores and awoke a slumbering evil. But perhaps it was all necessary to bring about a brighter future. It is time to reflect on the past with a new perspective. That is why I am here, along with those of the Infinite Dragonflight who I, who I could convince to join me. Does this mean you believe in the true timeline? I'm like, go on. I remain skeptical of Nostarmu's faith in it, but I'm willing to give his wisdom the benefit of the doubt. Let's talk about something else. I want to go back to that. Um, does this mean you believe in the true timeline now? I remain... Okay, so basically says the same thing. Um, what is my mission? Relive this timeline so that we may observe the events from a new perspective. We will be watching you. What will be different? We will equip you with an artifact of the infinite, a cloak that adapts and changes as you do. The Zdormu is opposed to altering the past. We are not doing so, are we? The events that transpire here will remain the same. It is you who will be different. Let's talk about something else. It's about Remember, time. Remember, some rules are meant are chaos to the be artificer. broken. This lieutenant has been causing collateral damage to the timeline in his hunger for temporal artifacts. It's about time. Your timing is serendipitous. I require your assistance. Not all infinites have seen what Nostromo has shown me. Not all will agree, even if they had. Arceus is one such detractor. He must be eliminated. Say Arceus the Artificer. So we're, we're already we killing. meet again. Oh, it's going to continue to Arceus is dealt with. Okay. So let's go deal with it. Where are you, my friend? My enemy? My person I need to kill? I feel like I should level up first, but why not? Why? Why bother? We'll do this first. Last time when I did this on the PTR, I... I explored a lot more. <laughs> There's really no like looting is weird too. Um there is yeah. loot, but there's not loot. Our paths uh, oh, cross oh. at last. Oh, it's about so. time. May your possibilities be The infinite. other infinite the other infinites jeopardize our mission. We can okay, it's the empty spool of temporal threads. Question everything. Reckless. They have unraveled the threads of time. Complete quest. Remember. Take this spool to Mortar to Moratari. Perhaps she can make sense of this relic. Speak with Moratari. And I get my first bronze! May your possibilities be It is good to see you here. Seeking expert advice. Moratari. What do you have there? This artifact is absolutely radiating with temporal power. Moratari leans in for a closer look. Ah, even more brilliant than I thought. Assimilating the latent temporal signatures of unraveled causalities. Sorry, I'm getting ahead of myself. Allow me to explain. Fair skies and strong winds. The other infinites are not as judicious in their treatment of the timeline. They have rather torn through time in their reckless opposition to our efforts. Though we cannot simply mend the timeways, may yet repurpose its loose threads, reclaim the threads of time from our enemies, and we shall weave you a cloak worthy of the infinite dragonfly. Collect three threads of time for the infinite ravagers. Pleasant spending time with you. <laughs> when studying the timelines, we infinite dragons usually seek to change things for the better. 
but Nosdarmu has told us to leave these events as they were. Luckily, he didn't say anything about changing your part in them. Or Atari Winks. We will always find a way to conduct proper research. Not my problem. Sands be in your favor. <laughs> these temporal anomalies are getting out of out of control. Normally, our research does not unravel the timeline this much. I suspect the other infinites are to blame. Use this chromo stabilizer to zip up the frayed rifts. Be aware, this may briefly create even more anomalies. I trust you know how to handle them. Use the chrono stabilizer to close three time rifts. You will receive 20 silver and experience. So I'm going to accept it. Always that. a pleasure. We're going to make a side trip, though. And I know she put a marker on my head. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so before we do that, we're going outside the sphere. And it is not loaded with enemies over here. That uh, normally, if you go to the Timeless Isle for reals, um, there would yeah. be things that would, there'd be like max level things that would crush you. So, okay, good, you're right behind me. So let's go. And mostly I came over here to see like, it's exactly the same. You could even buy some noodles if you so choose. Listen to the but you don't have nearly enough gold because you don't get are gold. Yummy. Hello. You can't enter the pet battle, but you could buy them, but you don't have Jade anything to buy them with because <laughs> they didn't change that. Um, the celestials are there. If you you can challenge Wait, one, happens? let's challenge you on uh, and see what happens. I would die. Oh yeah, absolutely. So Yulon, well here I'll sh let me do this first. Do, 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 do. Talk to our, our favorite crane person. <laughs> let me in. Oh, Kairos. Norm I can normally I can get closer than this. All right. You got Anduin. I've seen such a place. <laughs> With his headband. Oh, God. The poor kid. <laughs> Laura Walker Cho. Keep your guard up. Oh, hey, left and right. Yep, because look who else is here. Hmm. Farewell. Teenage Rathion. Yeah. Rathion. He's only two years old in Dragon Years. I see no one gets to see, even in this, apparently. Um, so, which I, I was like, well, it won't, if anyone else comes over here, won't they see this and be like, how the hell did this happen? Uh, <laughs> I'm just saying, but let me see something. I don't think that's enough to get, yep, you talk to him, you open up the rep for, for it. Oh, really? You just talk to him and the rep open opens up. Oh, snap. It did open up. Yep. So you can get the rep to show up. High jump. Now, the only way to get rep with him, now that they've removed every other means, mm -hmm. is to kill a celestial once a week. <laughs> It's a very long grind. but And it doesn't get you anything else. Now, Yulon, I apologize for this. Learn from your mistakes. Oh, damn. <laughs> but I had, to, I had to do it for the data. I had to do it for the data. And it doesn't leave you in a good spot either. Which is why I put the mount on. Learn from your mistakes. Rude. But I can open up the flight point after doing that. Oh, it's good. a shortcut to the flight point. Yeah. So, oh, but then you do have enemies. So, one of those death uh -huh. adders who I used to be terrified of way back when. Oh, because they're terrifying. So, I just have to. I think I just have to go along the beach. I should be fine. Bop and leave. 
bob and weave. But I have to be careful because I think Horde will attack. Okay, there's the time thing. Actually, the time thing is right by the Horde camp. So, now I will go back to doing what I was supposed to do now that I've picked up that. Um... Oh, I don't have throw? I don't want to throw yet. God. Whoops, a daisy. I don't have throw? Really? At what level do I get freaking throw? What kind of. So, it's not a complaint against what we're witnessing. It's more a. I'm used to roguing at a higher level. Oh my god. Like, I'm like, I can shadows. No, I cannot shadow step. For I am too low a level. I have to run on my little gnome legs. I have to run on my little, little gnome legs. No, no. To get after enemies. Honestly, at least it's less busier than it was on the PTR where it's like you had to queue up to kill shit. Oh, wow. I did get up to level. Yeah, I 20 or 30, I forget what. Like, it went pretty quick. I just need more talents that I can use. Like... See. Yeah, it won't let me through. I bet it has, uh, it won't let you through on the other end if you're a horn. Mm. Like, there was a war going on, remember? Auto loot on. That's. Oh, there's a group bonus. Interesting. There's a group bonus. Well, yeah, because I actually turned on um to show XP in chat because I'm always curious. And so when I was filling things, it was like, oh, like um, it died. You got 36 XP, and then in parentheses it has plus four group bonus. Huh. I'll take it. Uh... Auto loot. Oh. Slowly but surely, we're getting to normalcy. I want my fan and knives. Okay, I've got my threads of fate. Did I. Oh, I did everything. Okay. I was just pretty much killing things to kill things. Let's go here. I mean, if you were close enough, you would have gotten credit for closing the things anyway. As always, oh, wait, on time. Leave it, leave it to Until me. Until next time. This has been time well spent. Be mindful of your time, hero. Oh, I wasn't reading stuff. I meant to read stuff. Damn it. <sighs> All right. What's yours is ours. Horos, our antiquities collector, should have a chrono badge you can use to fasten together the temporal threads you collected. With the chrono badge, Momentus can craft the threads into a powerful cloak for you to wear. Purchase a chrono badge from Horos, then speak with Momentus. Sands be in your favor. What time is it? Bad that cloak will be able to absorb glorious. loose threads of time, adding them to your own magic. The prospect of infinite power is enticing, is it not? Just don't let it go to your head. Let it go to your cloak instead. Your <laughs> giggles. 
This okay, I'm glad I got that line because I was very amused by that line the first time. Alright. It's only good to get like, What do you want? Don't have to be so rude. Um, Chrono Badge. And here you get to see the other some of the other things you can spend your bronze on when you have them. I'm going to try to get all of these because that's what I do. Whatever you're making, woman, just can force Trust you. only your eyes. You're late. Oh, different timeline. Fair skies and strong wind. There's Momentus. Speak your truth. Who are you? Oh no, I just spoke to you. Moment. What do you want? We forge our own futures. With enough bronze, I can forge yours. I will be able to upgrade your equipment. Momentarily. Can you forge this thread and turn a badge into a cloak? Go now. Can I? Ha! It's only take a moment. There. Go in good time. Right, you forge your own future. Oh, I thank you. It is an honor, champion. That cloak will be able to absorb those threads of time. Okay, there we go. Always a pleasure. Wonderful. Try this on. With the temporal magic in this cloak, you'll be able to see and collect scattered threads of time. There is no limit to how many you can have. The possibilities are infinite. Be mindful of your time oh, here. <laughs> Once you don your cloak, you'll be able to find threads on an enemy. The cloak will naturally absorb those threads, permanently increasing your power. Try collecting a thread from the nearby infinite ravagers. Equip your cloak of infinite potential and collect a thread of power from an infinite ravager. Until next time. Yay! What did you dip your face? So the cat gets on my lap, and I'm like, oh, hey, cat. And, like, why is your entire lower half of your face wet? You just shove your face in the fountain. Oh. Uh, there's also a uh, Torin DK called Chipotle Mayo. <laughs> or Chipotle Mayo, if you prefer. Alright, uh, Chipotle. Going where? Chipotle Mayo. Uh thread of power infinite ravager can i hit you in time let's find out who am i killing oh i'm oh, killing one of these i know i gotta yeah, kill the big sandy the dude over there eventually yeah at least i got all the way to find anduin before he like mind controls someone and runs away i'm like <laughs> My dude! I was trying to help. He's like, I'm sorry, hero. I'm like, no, you're not. No, I want to be free! Like, I just want to sing! Like, sorry. You have arrived. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that, yeah, that tracks. That tracks. That tracks. That tracks. <laughs> oh, God. I'm so mad that closed early. Oh, I'm so mad, too. Because, like, it wasn't like it wasn't doing well. Like, it, it was selling. Uh, are you gonna help my guy? Sorry. With this cloak's temple magic, you can see and collect scattered threads of time. Such threads can be found anywhere within the timeline. From enemies you defeat oh, to no. treasures you collect, your cloak will absorb the threads in its own, permanently increasing its power. There's no limit to how many threads you can collect. So let's talk about something else. Cloak and needle. Spending time with you. You'll find similar threads everywhere, from same phones to loot treasures, plus poofy balls in the sky. Always a pleasure. <gasps> oh, you, the, you know the greeny poofs and the dragon isles? They're bronzy poofs. They're bronzy poofs. Um, I, which I will be going on a bronzy poof hunt, and I'm going to the tavern in the mists next, just so you know. Uh, goodbyes are hard when you live forever. We have one one last anomaly to deal with before we can study the history of Pandaria. Help us stabilize the time way and secure our mission. Defeat Eratus, the unwoven paradox. Until so next time. Ah, uh, 
So, um, thank you. Thank you for helping out. <laughs> so what happens here is... This is the... the you'll see. We'll... <laughs> oh, come on. Let me attack. All right, you think yourselves clever? Oh, okay. You know now what echoes from you. I'll read that after I kill it. I don't have I don't have the type of power. Go, we'll take it from here. So. There's Eternus. Hey, Eternus. There Remember when I helped you that one, one time? Way to solve any problem. It wasn't on this character. All right. <laughs> either one of those. Either of those times. Um, so, what happens from this point is you now leave the Timeless Isles, I believe, at this point. Um, and there will be pockets in Pandaria where they've set up. And they'll be in places that there were sometimes other events like Half Hill, where your farm was. They're there. There's no cooking to learn. There's no Nomi to teach. Uh, they're there. So after this, I am going to hop on. Well, we're going to see because I know there's a Rostam of Power. And I want to open up writing so you could actually ride me. When sending the timelines, we usually seek to check things. Okay, that said before. Goodbyes are hard when you live forever. This has been time well spent. Thank you for your aid in battle, Granny Stabs. I'm sure Eternus will have need of you yet. Be mindful of your time, hero. Our operation here. Our operations here are secure, for now, anyway. It's time for you to begin... It's time for you to begin your journey to the past so that we may observe how history unfold, unfolded. Speak with Eternus if you have any final questions about your mission. She can show you how these events began. Ask Eternus to show you the events of the past. Unlike the following, group finder. Sand so, be in your favor. what will happen is you will now be sent to the beginning of Mr. Pandaria. Um, it is good to see you here. Fair skies and strong I'm just winds. debating if I should do this first because you literally will be showing... Oh, yes. We do want to do this first. Change is good. What events led, to the, led the alliance to Pandaria? I will be doing this on Horde. Um, I have a hunter ready to go. Uh, Torin, that will be you doing this on. What events of the Alliance of Pandaria? Here we go. We've made a thorough inspection of the wreckage, Your Majesty. There is no sign of Admiral Taylor or his ship. Two hundred ships at my disposal, yet the one carrying my son goes missing. What of their last message? Show me whatever you have. We have been drawn off course. Horn air fleet. Any casualties? Shipwrecked on an uncharted isle. But the White Pawn is accounted for. Repeat, the White Pawn is safe. And doing. Surprise attack! Requesting immediate if anyone's received. Sir, the Seventh Fleet has already been dispatched, but it could take weeks before it. There's no time to waste. We'll send a small elite force to secure this new land and bring back my son. Varian sporting uh, still wrath look. Um, it's funny because later. On Varian. Well, it, it's Sorry. really obvious during the end of this expansion when Vol'jin oh. looks amazing. And it, it's like. Everyone else, like, Varian still is, like, an ex expansion in half behind, graphically. Um, so, yeah. Here begins. So, this is Pandaria. It's actually Eternus is there. Um, Sky Admiral Rogers is 
Where is... Well, we're still looking for um, Admiral Taylor. <laughs> so just hanging out here. Nothing to see, nothing to see here. Sky Admiral Rogers. What's the situation? We need to familiarize ourselves with Sky Admiral Rogers because she, she's an issue. Um, the Skyfire has has had a complete overhaul since our encounter with Deathwing. Remember Deathwing? Yeah, this is the this is the ship you fight Deathwing on. That you jump off of actually the ship onto is Spine. The ship is so cursed. yeah, it's cursed. This is this is the uh, the Skyfire. Has had a complete overhaul since the encounter with Deathwing. We now carry full complement of both fixed wing and gyro aircraft as well as a battery of 18 inch smooth bore shore bombardment cannon shore the horde won't be able to hide from her reach not on land not at sea not in the air you really have it in for the horde don't you the sky admiral's face grows hard i grew up in south shore my parents are buried there what's left of them do your duty soldier so, if you want to know why she's a little bit angry, she's justified, I think, in that. I mean, you can't really you can't really argue with that. However, <laughs> is that Kelsey still spark? No, no. Hey, Kelsey. You know that scene of the build and broken, stripped or soldiered, cracked or cobbled. You come to the right Off engine. Of the way. Um, let's see. I'll talk to Eternus in a second. I'm just I'm just taking a little quick look around. Yeah. Okay, so these characters do come in later. Uh, Mishka. How can I help you? We have SI7 agents here. Can I help you? Mishka is one. She's she's healing. Where is Rel Nightwind you saw in the cutscene? He didn't always have pink hair. Right? Yeah, he did. Yeah, he, he did? did. Yeah, he did. Oh, wow. Okay. Ah, uh, here they go. They're over here. I knew they were on here somewhere. Now, here you all... Here, here you see... Oh, it's kind of purplish. In the cutscene, it's... But, mm -hmm. real night wind. Um, you can't talk to any of them, but here's Amber Kiernan. <laughs> oh. And here is Sully the Pickle McCleary. Sully the Mc Pickle McCleary. <laughs> Me no socks. All right, you know, he's still Aww. morning socks. He shows of up course. at the trading post looking for a pet and then just can't do it. But anyway. So let's talk to Eternus. There is more than one way to solve any problem. A contentious moment in time, one that echoes into the present. Moratari and the others will be waiting at a nearby village with supplies. I, I expect to learn much from watching your progress, recalling the war. We will meet. Good again. luck, Granny Stabs. We will be watching you. We will unlock access to the following group finder. We will also receive two silver. Yay! Question everything. A stowaway? Whoever you are, I need all hands on deck. Hi. This is the most powerful ship in the fleet. I'm winning to unleash this gunship against a worthy target. Let's spend some ammunition. Unleash hell. For the Alliance. Unleash hell. I will not let the Horde gain a foothold on these shores before we do. If you're looking to jump into the fray, I've got a spare gyrocopter for you at the end of the runway. An attack run is ready. Programmed in. All you have to do is concentrate on shooting. Unleash hell upon those orcs. Use the Skyfire gyrocopter to slay 60 of the Garrus troops and destroy 8 Garrus dreaders. And let them sink into Blade Fist. And then sink the Blade Fist Reaper and the Stygian Scar. Blah, blah, blah. Um, you'll receive cash of infinite treasure. You'll also receive. Now, I can show them what we're made of. Over here, Granny Seb, your gyrocopter's ready. I thought Time is setting you sad. pick up. Not or maybe it's stone. after this part. Okay. You pick up your tools, which is allows you to trash shit. <laughs> what in blazes is uh, this? It's afterwards, yeah. Admiral, uh, we're seeing a significant native presence here. Or 
ancient structures. Cut the chatter, people. Eyes on the target. See, there's a sparkly wow. poop it, up there. You heard the Admiral. Concentrate fire on the Horde base. Begin your attack runs. I'm not gonna lie, you do feel you are you should feel bad in this quest. Um, yeah. Because it gets bad. Well yeah. done. No mercy. Use your torpedo rockets on those ships. Confirm kill. Nice shooting. Are you like literally riding each other's tails here right now? Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that is so funny because it's so like just overlap kind of glitching. Yeah, in. it's really funny. It's like when you ride like the kind of like, hanging back. ride. Hit him with everything you've got. That one's for Theramore. Mm. I mean, reasons why I knew I had to, reasons why I knew I had to play both sides when I Negative started playing Pandaria no is I was like, I need to be on the other side. Absolutely. Garish is an asshole, but I need the other side. So yeah. None of my characters were Garish loyalists. Mm Do I? That's <laughs> All wings report back. This cool. Plus, Prepare for ground. An interesting way to explore like themes of like loss Victory and grief. Victory in battle is the only and, path to peace. Uh, tragedy the war. Mm. Like if folks are so inclined. I mean, it's kind of like the, the whole alliance. like the war back in the Warcraft, folks. It's like. The game has never had a pro-war beat your enemy down message when it was Horde versus Alliance. Not since Warcraft 2, and even then it was shifting. So, this whole... It, it's... It's, yeah, like, what game have you been playing? <laughs> anyway. What's yeah, the situation? I that particularly what, like this quest line yeah like if you're looking to to showcase how to tell stories and you know empathy kind of building through games this quest line is like you know perfect for it yeah exactly it's like you bring your shit to pandaria and the literal manifestations mm -hmm. of your hate come out exactly <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah it's like Terran Zoo is going to show up any moment now. Okay. And be like, what the hell is your problem? Why are you here, colonizers? Exactly. <laughs> yeah. Unleash hell. Show them what we're made of. But Proper welcome for the horde to this new land. Do your duty, soldier. I went up a level, yay. All right. Touching ground. Their town is burning and their men are scattered and broken. I need every available man on the ground now to finish them off. Grab one of the parachutes on the edge of the ship and get down there. Use the Skyfire parachute and touch ground and Garish, Garish's, Garish our point. Then speak to Sully, the Pickle, and McCleary. Show them what we're made right. of. Here's my stuff. I'll deal with my telepoints in a second. Men, you've trained for this. You're among the elite. 
You are Skyfire men. This is the ship that took down Deathwing. You think some raggedy little horde outpost stands a chance against the pride of the Alliance fleet? No! Those green dirtbags down there plagued your Lady. homes in South Shore, laid right? siege to your children in Red Ridge, and massacred every man, woman, and child in Theramore. It is payback time! Okay. So but, let's look at what we have here. Uh, I'm gonna go now. So extract gem allows you to your armor here you may notice has something different. It's got these little pockets here. They're your gem slots. You plug gems into them and have a really good fun time. Um, when you find armor that's better than what you have, and you probably have some in your stash that you can't use, well, first let me open that. Aha! We get our first gems. Gems of power. You have found a gem that improves your combat capabilities and socketed it into a prismatic socket found in your chest or leg armor. Socket this chipped deadly sapphire into your equipment to increase your critical strike chance. Shift right click your chest. It's basically how you would socket gems normally. So, well, I have an unraveled unraveling tunic. We'll get to that in a second. Chip deadly sapphire. And now we just, we have a chest. We have pants. Let's put it in our pants. It gives us critical strike. So, just like you would. Shift, click, open your sock, socket, stick your jam in, apply. But, and then we will accept this. During your journey through Pandera, you will find many more gems that improve your combat capabilities. Complete. Um, extract a gem. Any gem can be removed from your equipment using extract gem ability. This gem will not be destroyed. This is important to know. Extract a gem now. And that's what you should use your little tool. Go into your pants. And you got your gem back. I accepted it. I forgot to actually <laughs> do it. Not, I'm doing quests without accepting them. You can freely change the gems in your equipment using the extract gem ability. Make use of ability as your collection grows. So, combine gems. Prismatic gems can be combined to create a more powerful gem. Combine three deadly chip sapphires to create a flawed deadly sapphire that grants additional critical strike when socketed. Use three deadly chip sapphires to combine them into a flawed. We do that by clicking on them. Jeez. Combine gems. As you find additional gems of the same type, you can combine them to make increase your combat capabilities. So I'm getting credit from doing these little how do you use your shit? So we'll just put that gem back here. And apply it. And now I've got more critical strike. Um now the next one is a scrap of bronze. The vendors of Pandaria do not want the equipment you find in this timeline. You can convert unwanted equipment into bronze using the magic of the infinite dragonflight. Use the unraveling sands ability and scrap the unraveling tunic. Use the unraveling sands ability to summon unraveling sands, then place the unraveling tunic. Okay, well, let's just find a nice spot over here. So you click on it. You get a little, little doohickey here. You open it up. You get this. It looks very much if you've done Legion, like the obliteration thingy. Very much like that. And you can put all your stuff in it and the unraveling tunic. Wait, hold on a second. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to destroy this because apparently this is not collected. You already are on that quest. Oh. It's all the things are messing with me. Never mind. It's meant to be unraveled. Along with my swords since I'm not, I'm not going outlaw. Scrap. You can place unwanted equipment into the unraveling sands to obtain additional bronze for your journey. Continue. Bronze can be spent at an infinite, at infinite bazaar to so upgrade your equipment, acquire gems, or expand your collection. So I have some bandage. Time runner's bandage. I'll put that in here. Not normally where to keep my bandits where I get my heartstone, but I don't get one right now. 
So that's how it works. And we'll be getting more and more pieces as we go through and managing this. The bags are very generous, but I would say begin organizing them sooner rather than later is what I discovered. Checking everybody. We'll tell her. Victory in battle is the only path to peace. All right. And now I guess there's nothing else to do here, really. What is this? Unraveling sands. Oh. I, I don't. It's, it's weird. I, I couldn't see your unraveling sands. I I don't. I think I just clicked on yours, even though I couldn't see it. I can't see it. Oh, that's wild. But I was yeah. like, well, I can click now, on something. Yeah. Yeah. yeah um, that's wild. All right. Let's parachute in. I'm so funny. Like, in unison. <laughs> it's like, <laughs> Wee! that's just weird. That's see, there's poofy. a poof. There's that's a poofy like... thing. Did you see the bronzy poof? I'm oh. about to fly back up there and get it. Good luck. Godspeed. Well, I'm uh, hoping to find a rostum of power. Actually, uh, I know where one is. But we'll get past this part, and then I know where it is. Um, I got the nice. right tool for the job. Hi, Sully. Hey, Sully. About time you showed up, Lassie. Let's do some damage. Complete. You got something to report? Let me see what's in my here. I haven't. Oh, I, that's right. I got a skill point. <laughs> Take care of that. Um, let me deal with that before I accept Sully's stuff. Oh, deadly poison! Hello. No, that's not that's not where you put that. <laughs> that's not where you put that game. All right, so deadly poison is preferable. We want deadly poison. We want crippling poison. Those are our two. What do you need? Those that came on the Skyfire are the Alliance's finest. Still, there's some things that only SI7 can pull off. No plan survives contact with the. No plan survives contact with the. I get the right tool for the job. Quickly and quietly, that's how SI7 prefers to operate. That was the plan, at least. Rel Nightwind is already inside Garrish's Point, looking for signs of Anduin and Taylor. But it's getting hot in there, and he needs support. Fight your way through these dogs and find Rel. Kill six Garishar grunts and six Garishar gear greasers. You got something that needs fixing? Do you see the size of those war wagons? They're packing so many, ex so many explosives I cannot tell if the horde is here to take over the continent or just blow it out of the sea. We need to neutralize those wagons before we leave Garishar Point. Here, take, take my pocket flyers. Fire him to the wagon and watch the fireworks. Use Sully's flare gun to destroy five horde war wagon. War five horde war wagons. Mm -hmm. What do you need? <laughs> wagon. I could probably turn off my uh, notification for Dragon's Bank. Actually, I'm not. That will be useful <laughs> while I'm leveling. That will be useful while I'm leveling and go, okay, maybe I'll swing by uh, one of the other ones in, in normal. All right, so we got war wagons. We got grunts. We've got the greasers who wear goblins. We're just gonna kill some stuff. Actually, I am curious. Come over here by me. Well. I don't think I was supposed to kill him, but it's alright. No, I don't think you have to, but... Just have to speed. Alright. Alright. I'm getting on my bronze... My sandstone drag. Hop on. Normally I would dragon ride this, but... I'm, I'm having pity on you. But I want to see if you get credit for this. Oh, yeah. I got some bronze. And four. Where'd it go? It was. Fun. Oh, this one. Okay. I'm not gonna be. I'm not gonna be kept away from my poofs. Oh, 
Oh, it's actually good. I didn't some realize damage. regular flight worked here. I thought just dragon flight. No. Regular flight works no. here. I was not aware. Ooh, I'll take it. I love when the when the the uh, wagon's right in front of me and I can't tell. Ha ha. I managed to take out two at once. I'm not even sure how that happened. <clears throat> Actually, the eviscerate should be two. That's going to get replaced by uh, envenomate, envenom, but. That's, I don't, haven't learned it yet. Ooh, I got a GM. I'll suck at it later. I did run, like, I am familiar with a lot of, uh, I ran a lot of characters through Pandora, <laughs> now that I think about it. Not all the way through, but... I got experience gain, okay. Yeah. Hop on quick. I'm on. Alright, this is where we blow down barricades. At ease, soldier. Rel is hanging out in um on um in a Mirdrasil now, where the, the hunter place is. Hmm. Back to your duties. He is in. He is in my. He is in my story. Great work. Have you ever decided to give up your life adventure? <laughs> yes, I seven could use more talent like you. Goodbye. Those wagons out of commission. We can turn our attention to the command. Commander. I'm counting on you. The right tools for the job. I scanned the area and found no leads on the Prince or Admiral Taylor. We need to neutralize the base quickly and continue our search elsewhere. Operations here are being led by an orc warlock, Gatrul. He's barricaded in the he's barricaded the dock and is trying to escape through the demonic circle. Put that flare gun to work again and blow those barricades. I'll cover your back and move when you reach Gatrul. Use Sully's flare gun to clear out the barricades and confront Gatrul at the end of the docks. Back to your duties. Get rid of the stuff. Ooh, we got a health potion. 
Uh, I'm going to start moving stuff. A timeless scroll of battle shout. Increases the attack power of all raiding party members with 100 jars for one hour. Eh, right. So that's a warrior talent. Um, so that's another thing. I'm going to start making my gem, my gem, uh, my gem bag here. I'm going to move my health potion down to where my health potions usually stand. Stand. Or whatever. There were some people complaining like, so that's it? It's Pandaria? Yeah, it's kind of Pandaria Extra? It's like... With different talent, like, yeah. What, what, were you expecting? <laughs> it's Seasons of Discovery. Yeah. In retail, which I think is pretty cool. Our sweat and your blood, this land will be ours. A warlock. He couldn't have ported far. Okay, but I know one of the complaints was, base. why didn't you bring back, like, original Pandaria skill trees? Like, they weren't going to do that. This this Nobody was not that. that. Nobody wants that. <laughs> he got away. Keep your mind on the mission. We'll catch up with him again, I'm sure. We'll catch up with him again, I'm sure of it. Good. Nightwind, report. What's going on down there? No sign of the flagship. No sign of Admiral Taylor or Prince Andor. Horde troops are swimming towards your position. Open fire at once. Admiral, I think they mean to surrender. They're not armed. They're just trying not to drown. You don't think they'll hesitate to strangle you with their bare hands? Gun them down! That's not right. This is a massacre. They were unarmed. I... I don't... I don't feel well. Maybe they deserve to die. You beasts! What sort of madness is this? Men, stand down! This is one of the natives. We are from the Alliance and mean you no harm. Tell well? me, what was that shadow you drew out of me? This is not the place to explain. In short, your own doubts have been made manifest as a consequence of your actions. You don't understand. We're fighting a war here. Oh. Stand perfectly. I have eyes. But Pandaria is not like whatever land you came from. It lives and breathes. You should be careful what kind of energy you bring here. Now put those weapons away. Terrence? Sorry. Is Ralph voiced by Travis? You know, I, it's like something about his voice is very familiar. Keep your eyes open. Give me a second, because I think I did look it up fairly recently. Travis. Okay, okay, I'm not crazy. Okay, because I was like, that sounds like Travis. Yeah, it's Travis. Like we're on first name basis because clearly we are. But yeah. um Best Buds. Yeah. Hang all the time. <laughs> so Travis Willingham, uh, for anyone <laughs> listening after the fact, uh, if you don't know what critical role is, fine. Um, but in game he's Terrellian at the moment. He's also um Gaslo. Mm -hmm. So yeah, he's 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 around. Um but Rel Nightwind, I knew that at some point too. I'm like, I, 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 
and I just keep forgetting it, but I'm like, yeah, hell. Reporting in. Keep your mind on the mission. Keep your eyes open. At ease, soldier. Keep your mind on the mission. Reporting in. At ease, soldier. Keep your eyes open. I don't think Reporting he has. Reporting in. At ease, soldier. Yeah, pretty much. He's all business. All right. <laughs> So real. So just gesturing. Okay. Reporting in. Envoy of the Alliance. I'm counting on you. North of this base, Cherry Blossom Orchard, and the village tucked away behind it. We will need to quarter there and tend to our wounded while we plan our next move. Head to that village and make contact with the native leader. Agent Mishka and I will rendezvous with you there. Be cautious, Granny Staffs. I am authorizing you to represent the entire alliance here. Granny Staffs. <laughs> Granny. Staffs. I'm banking that seeing a powerful alliance hero like you would make a favorable impression. I literally woke up today for the first time ever. So <laughs> find and meet with the leader of Pawdon Village. Goodbye. The cost of war. This whole place is going up in flames and the Skyfire is reporting that more of those shadows are crawling up out of the ground. We need to get our people out of here. Clear a path through the base. On your way north and head for the town. I will rendezvous, rendezvous with you there. Slay ten Shah haunts and five Shah harbingers um, in Garish's point. I don't See, it's 11.27. Back to your duties. I know which part I want to get up to, but I'm not going to get as far as I had hoped. You might want to at least get to the village, and then we can kind of... Well, yeah, I want to go to the village. On the mission. I even wanted to kind of get as far as uh, sure. Lorwoka Cho's part. Yes. Um, give them hell for us, Granny Steps. Whatever those things are. They're all right. This might be yeah, weird, what... but like, has the blood, like the clouds of blood, always been as obvious in the water? Yes. Oh wow. Okay. I am targeting something. Stupid shod goo. So yeah, I want to get up to Pawdon Village. Open up the flight point. Because I want to get to the area where I can start looking at, like, one of the hubs for the bronze yeah. dragon flight. And then I'm going to go by half hill. I'm going to laugh and see if the Shah of Anger is out yelling at people. And then... Oh my God. Complained about totally stuff that's not so in this. <laughs> literally killing things before I can get a spell off. That's great. Sorry. <laughs> no, you're fine. Don't be sorry about. I'm an assassin. I just think it's funny. As long as you're getting credit. Like, I'm getting credit. I don't always get to loot sometimes, but yeah. But take your credit is the important thing. I'm sorry. Tell me to slow down oh, then. Sure. You're good. Oh, the respawn rate of these things is super fast. They've always been super fast. I mean, especially so because other people are here now. Mm -hmm. I hate that when it does that shit. All right. I mean, there's a point you reach where you realize you're you are now power, more powerful than anything else around. I think the weird thing about Pandaria Remix is it uses the leveling with you thing which was not the case at the time correct because that started with legion i believe Maybe. 
I think it started with Legion. I remember because I was like, wow, it's been a long time since I've had that shit kicked out of me by Murlocs. <laughs> gonna give me your crap plus two stamina damn right you're gonna give me your shit okay where am i going caught in village i'm intentionally <laughs> not mounting up because i do want to kill things along the way because i yeah. am sort of have a mind on i want to hit another level before port in village i mean we're so close to doing that yeah that's why i'm like well yeah I Oh, that's Sully's in there. <laughs> like, I can't kill Sully. Experience gain. I didn't get experience gain things in, um... Oh, they're not shooting me. They're shooting past me. I didn't get experience gain bonuses in, uh... The PTR, I don't remember. It may have just been be luck, but I feel like I'm getting more boosts here than I did during the PTR. Like I'm even I'm leveling I'm like I'm moving along even faster. Or I'm just imagining things. Both are highly likely. I could take on all three of you. Maybe. Possibly. So How did I get only two bronze from all that mess? Wow, oh, I see something I forgot key. to loot. Well, I think we separated out. So, like... What you're finding another might be loot that I had because I just ah. grabbed loot off and you just killed it over there. Oh come on, so close! Just give me more to, or I could just go in and then there'll be more to kill. Or you could um, just turn in the quest and do it. Twelve yeah. XP. I want to see if I can get more shit to drop. I gotta do a bag check. Fair. Cataclysm Classics? I don't care if you're updating right now. Please get off my screen. Thank you. Um... Aha! I got another thing. Um, so Amethyst. Versatile Diamond. So I'm not gonna put those in just yet. I have a feeling there's going to be an armor thing soon. I need my headpiece so I can wear my headpiece. I think that gets like a special diamond so that it's where you start dealing with gear slots. There it is. There we are. Talent point. All right. When the stranger comes from our village, a rogue by the look of it. Hey, your mom's a rogue. Um, Your mama. Do not draw your weapons against us as the horde did. Um, as you are standing there with your knives out. <laughs> I'll put them away. Alright. Down point. Oh, shadow step. <laughs> or evasion. I need both, but I want my shadow step now. <laughs> I want my shadow step now. There we go. See, watch. Whee! I'm behind you! Now I gotta wait for it to recharge for 26 seconds because I don't have the double charge <laughs> that I do now. It was worth it. Oh yeah, more ways for um, me to lose you. What have you got, Trader? Thick hide peg. 
literally nothing I, I can't even buy because it's too expensive. But, um... Yeah. Yeah, that's right. You can't sell anything. You can Enough buy stuff, that. but it's useless. Yeah. I'm going to open up the flight point. Black talent agent. Just casually strolling through town. Hi. Yeah, as one does. <laughs> I'm just keeping my eyes open, Rogue. No harm in that. If you have any news for me, I will pass it along. If not, you best keep moving. See you around. Listen. <laughs> look, look at my title. I'm a big deal. Oh. oh gosh. Do you know who I am? I was annoyed that I couldn't use the toy to get all the Pandaria flight points. It's like, no, you can't use that yet. It's like, aww. So here we we have Nostwin, Snacks and Scrolls, who I love, and I want to be my best friend ever. Hi, can I interest you in, in a fancy paper or this jar of bees I found? Adorable. And, and basically sells uh sells bandages, sells health potions, sells um. Little scrolls and boosts and fun he stuff. Has a voucher. You can get a voucher. <gasps> oh my gosh. So I I love I love love. Them. Uh, I so, love them. I like there's things. Pet training manual, fetch, hunter. I already have that. Cliff of stars. I have. I think. But, Okay, Petra Man, play God, dead. The so there's other there's stuff to play around with here. Um I'm not gonna worry about that right now. Return to a nearby infinite bazaar. That might be useful, but I don't want to use my twenty just yet. But on the other hand On the other hand, I have 231. I think it's a good investment. Did it put somewhere? Oh, wait. It's supposed to be. All right. I'll worry about that later. Um. Let me check my skill book to see if anything new popped up there. Because not all abilities. Sprint is there. Do I have... Do not... Mutilate! Oh, thank God. Fine, I, okay. So, mutilate. And I'll just keep this over here for now. It's a macro. So, with alt, I can get to ambush. Even though I'm not going to be able to get that second part for a while. It's very useful currently. Okay, no, alright, I've dealt with you. Um, You're late. Oh, different timeline. Dragon riding. I am going to do this because it gets me access to the Nostrum of Power. The dragon flight thing. So, dragon riding. Pleasant spending time with you. Um, this land is more vast than I remember. However, a good scholar always prepares for contingencies. Two of the most airborne dragons have agreed to aid your cause. Yes, Lord Andestras. He will tell you it's a wonderful day for a race, but maybe not this time. They will provide you a winged mount so you can cover more ground. I will send you to Lord Andestras and he shall instruct you further. Take Mortari's portal to Lord Andestras. So we are going to do this. Sands be in your favor. It's an excellent day for a race. No, it's not. 
it's a red drake. So this is your accessibility mount right here, your red drake. How fair the winds today? Tell me about dragon riding. Let's pretend we haven't learned how to dragon ride, and I will move my details over to where it's about should be. All right. Haven't we done this before? No, we're, no, we're gonna do this. First, we didn't do it you here. will learn how to glide with a drake and move efficiently about the peaks. Come, let us get started with some quick lessons. Hold on, I'm gonna do this first. Let's make it infinite, come on. <laughs> I'm not going to get too fancy right now. Day of the Dead armor. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. The tattern. Excuse me, I got to my guts up now. All right, that's acceptable. I think I have to talk to her anyway, but... Well, then. Let us um, proceed. Damn. Go. No, I guess not. And Where's the one I gotta talk to? How about you? <laughs> there is someone who will give me the, uh... Friend ride-along, so I have to find out who that is. Oh, there she is. Look, she has a whole array. My wares were made with knowledge. I heard something about helping my fellow adventurers. Please enable passengers. Thank you for sharing. I wish you didn't have to specifically go to someone for that, but now I can dragon ride and you can hop on my back. Ah, caught a good wind stream lately. Complete quest. See you up there. How Keep your feet off the ground. Fast. Call upon your Drake companion. Then drop off the edge while moving forward. You will glide to your destination. Oh, I don't like that tail, but I'll deal with it. Wait. <laughs> okay, first of all, that doesn't go there. Where's my healing? Got it. How to glide with your dragon. It's not, aside for, from a different location, it's exactly the same as yeah. in the Dragon Isles. So that's why I'm not even doing my read all the dialogue thing. How to dive with your dragon. See you up there. As you aim for the ground, you'll pick up speed. Use this to fly faster. 
then level out to reach your destination. A good wind stream lately. Can you fly over Keep your feet off the ground. See you up there. All right, it's not. It's like I was treating you like it was a dragon race. Where's the timer? I use a whirling surge in there. The I sky showed off. calls. Fair skies and strong winds. I'm not even sure what I'm doing. the winds today the skies fashionable keep your feet off the ground you've learned all i can teach you see you up there so now i have to go over here and pretend that i didn't do this charmed already. there is a universal justice I just and it one. is life or you can fix the de detail that you didn't like yeah okay I like the spear. I like that they have the variety of Drake friends, but they don't have the Slither Drake up there, which is annoying. Oh, I guess this is your original four. Um, okay, Lord Andestros. The sky calls. Fashionable fly. Tell me about vigor. There's not nearly enough. Fair skies and strong winds. Now you are ready to fly. Off you go. Keep your feet off the ground. You must be on your way now. That portal should take you back to the village. Fair skies and strong winds. As always, on time. Time to return. Excellent. I hope this expedites our research. Always a pleasure. It most definitely will. Okay. So, I may pick up things here. I think I'm going to shift to exploratory mode. Now that I've got that. pick up that tomorrow. For now we will explore, get poofs. Open up flight points. Poof. 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 Poof.
Pandaria is so pretty, and like the last time that I ran through here, I was very sad to see the statue change, even though I knew it yeah. was going to happen. I still yeah, had that same moment of sadness. Yeah, so did I. I like I, when I flew by it um, on the PTR for this actually. Um, mm -hmm. I was like, oh right, we know where it's going inevitably. Like we haven't ruined this place yet. I'm trying to find the. Uh... Oh. Like right here. Yeah. <sighs> Welcome. Next one is on me. Tell me of your travels. I need a ride to the bottom Travel of the statue. Safe. But man, adventurers, we were, we ruined everything. Yep. I forgot this place is under attack. Oops. Mm -hmm. I may know that's where the dungeon is, but I was wanting to see if this still counts. Oh, yes! Ooh! Okay. I didn't, wasn't sure if this achievement was going to be achievable. Um, lore Masters. You collect a bunch of these and turn them in. I wasn't sure if that was... I honestly didn't think it was. Um... Where's the fly point? That's the other reason why I'm here. Looks like there's a daily quest over there. What's up with that? There's not supposed to be any dailies. Flight point. Are you able to click on the flight point? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Yeah. Um. What is this? Yeah, what is this daily that's over here? That should not be. Yeah, there's a few. Welcome, oh. wanderer. The August Spirits bless your path. Slow huh. down. Life oh, you can get stuff safer. for it. All right. Um, I'm not gonna do May it, but interesting to know that these passions. these dailies are here. They normally wouldn't be here at this level. I mean, you can do dungeons from like level ten, so like you can do I don't stuff right away. Where is so. the dungeon finder actually? Where's my dungeon finder? Speaking of finder. It's in the same spot it always is. Oh! Right, for some reason I forgot that it has to be active to, um... Scenarios! Yeah. Yes! Yeah, so I can't just, do anything uh, yet. Roll and go. Well, you have to select a roll. Oh god, that's right. So go back right. to dungeon. I got it. So go up. No. Nope. Pick a roll. I did. Oh, I can because I'm group leader. Oh, okay. So I can put us in something if you want to go in something. Not right now. Not just yet. Um, Random scenario. I wouldn't remember the huh. scenarios. Alright, so I'm doing a little... I'm covering, covering flight points. Yeah. I'm cover, covering ground. I, I do get experience... Mm -hmm. From uncovering the map, so this is all yes. all works in our favor. Apparently, pet battles are here, which is interesting. We'll be back there later.
Oh, I didn't open up the flight point. Jin Yu. Okay, I may not be able to. Oh, I can try. Miles, buddy, you are not okay. helping. Did you get it? Yes, I did. Thank you. All right. Even with so, Miles nudging my hand. That's how I was like, know, I know, I was like... Away. This quest. Defiance. Back there soon enough. Yeah, there looks like there's a. Yep. Pet battling. Which Welcome. A... Well, apparently you can't pet battle. Um. I hope to see you again soon. Okay, so the pet battlers are here, but you can't pet battle. That makes sense. I mean, you could take pets out, but you can't pet battle. Something in my eye. I thought I saw. Yeah, Dawn's Blossom. I thought I saw. Oh, this is the one that's. Here it is. This is basically a sped up version of how I do things in a new expansion. <laughs> Are you still commenting on my armor? Okay. Behold the wonders of Pandora. You can't buy anything. You can't repair anything. Family. You can't do any of that. Oh, I didn't realize that you couldn't repair. You don't need to. Although it I guess it makes sense. wise to shop yeah. here. Yeah. It's 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 jarring. It's like well, yes. oh, I wait, I can't oh wait, I don't need to. Where is the is it here? Oh, look, there's four of them. One, two, three. Let me get you. Four. <laughs> I don't think this is the one I think it is. No. I never remember where it is. I'm gonna find it again. Well, there's two spots I like to find. Oh, this is one of them. And someone else found it at the same time. There's no way to get down from here. So they apparently, um, you know, died playing their game. <laughs> I was trying to see what was in the cup. Well, there's nothing in the cups, but I don't. It looks no, like there is. There's. In the picture. Well, no, in the individual cups there isn't, but in the pictures, it looks like a die. Yeah. Yeah. It's just a wine and a die. Yep. 
So this is one of the spots I like to find. I can never remember where the hell it is when I do find it. Um, let me go over here. I will... Did you get it? Yes. I just want greeny poofs. And then I'm gonna grab this flight point here. I know there's a flight there. Wild things, available quests. It looks like it's, a, it's like a shield quest even. Which is Weird, but let me go look. Let's see what that's about. Did I? Yeah, I did uncover that. I just didn't fly past it. Oh, hello. Hi, oh. Turtus. Hey, what's up? Oh, right. Here's the whole hello. town. This is. There's a little town in here. Um, which is the bazaar. So, here, this is where the thing sends you to the scrolls that Nostrum sends. Uh, ah, I have just the thing for you. Be first careful. scene, complete a scenario. I'll be Good doing job. more of these later. I'm not yeah. just I'm not gonna get to that do it tonight. I wanna transmogrify my gear. But I can't do my head piece because I don't have one. Maybe the eternal sun shine but upon you can me. Get like... Looking for more, I believe this Dragon is self. Defeat two oh. raid bosses. Seek the truth. You seek answers? Do not share what Dungeons. I have said. Yeah, it is where you could buy all your stuff and spend all your bronze all in one yeah. spot. Um, here's your map. Hemet's here. Actually, Hemet. The 17th? Watch your back. I'll trust you for now. Let's see if I can. You can't upgrade that. <sighs> I get why I can't Seek upgrade my truth. It is what it is. Um, ah, I had to get to level 15. Interesting. Huh? I had to get to level 15. Oh, level... F okay, that's what it is. I knew there was something. Tell no lies. Yeah, 
Can't do until Don't level 15. At level 12. I don't know if I'll get to level 15 in the next half hour or so. But. So that is located up here by Chian Monastery. Oh, there's a fly point. All right. I thought there was a fly point. I want to make sure to grab the fly point. All right. And this one's just flapping around. Like, hey, how you doing? You can see Infinite Bazaar is there's a little teeny tiny hourglass on the map. Oh, yeah, there is. And like there's a little house there to tell you. So I was like, what is that there? Oh. Okay, back to touring. Why do you have a what? Like if I open up my quest log, I have a time drift quest. And it's red, obviously. Oh no, I don't have it. Weird. I need you village, that's the horde equivalent, but we're gonna take some, we're gonna steal their poops. Um. Did you get it? I got it, thanks. Awesome. Level 25 already. There's some people who have been playing since it started. It's three, yeah. I mean, it, you pick up levels pretty quick, so I mean, it's yeah. not like it's, a, like it's a hardship. It's just like... We're not like, I'm not blazing through quests right now, but. Yeah. You know, I'm. So you can see there's an infinite bazaar where Half Hill Market is, if you remember where that is. I wonder if Dog is in here. Ooh. Shiny, glowy gold things. Stuff in a bit, suppose. Go pick up here. Now, unfortunately, well, this is where the market was. It's now an yeah. infinite bazaar. Complete with Nostrum and everything else. Um, here's where your farm was. Yes. And there's Farmer Yoon, who you help out. Hello. I would have helped you, but they removed your quest from this. There is no. Yeah. There was your farm. Yeah. All right. So let's miss. It's like she's there, like, hey. Well, if you noticed, there was a uh, infinite. Yeah. Dragon 
guard thing stealth hanging out with the watching the farmer. Really? Yeah. He was stealth in the uh, bushes. I did not notice that. I'm slacking off. Yeah, he's right. Like right behind the scarecrow. So let's turn left and look oh, the Oh, yeah. Scarecrow. Yeah, there's two of them over there, actually. There's two of them, yeah. You Three arrived. of them. Oh, no, two. Four. Three. No, it's right. One. Yeah. What time two, is it? Three. <laughs> four. Yeah. Just hanging out with, the, you know, Farmer Yoon. <laughs> Like, you could at least help them, you know, guys. They can't. Yeah, I know. They're trying to be respectful. Mess, they mess with the timeline. That's our job to mess with the timeline. Because I'm sure nothing will go wrong. Well, the way it's looking is keeping things exactly as we think they are may not be right. Remember, why do you think the Titans are interested in our timeline. I want to preserve this timeline. And Chromie's like, the Titans protect her. I'm like, no, no, Chromie, Chrome, be quiet for a second. Let him talk. <laughs> That'll be useful for later. In fact, that is like. That is one of the, uh... Level boost! <laughs> the Veil of the Eternal Blossoms. This is clearly not Nazoth. This is clearly not, uh... But it is post-Garrosh. Which is annoying. Yeah. Because you can never get back to um, pre garage And. Yeah, I mean, not unless you're running it on retail. No. It's gone. Even on retail with a, it's even gone. On retail with a fresh character? It's gone. Oh, I didn't realize that. It's one of the things that, that upsets people that was removed from the game. Is oh, the whole was... the whole Anduin going into the Veil of the Eternal Blossoms? Like, I need to find the Veil. Yeah. Originally, you walked in; it was pristine, right? That, and you got to do daily questing. The outcome... Yeah, yeah. And then Gara showed up, and it stayed. It, it, it this is the state now, right? I just assumed it was phase. Nope. Oh, that sucks. It's, it's not phase. It's gone. Oh my goodness. The, um, is it eternally in the veil is the feet. I'll just put veil. Eternally in the veil. Um, which of course I cl I clearly don't have on this character, but right. yeah, it's the um, plate the following milestones with the golden lotus. Um, Tori earned it. I'm pretty sure Arleia earned it as well, um, but more T Matori may have earned it first. So yeah. Oh, I don't have that. It was. It was the, a specific quest line in the Vale before Garrosh came in and fucked it. Oh, that's frustrating, yeah. It's frustrating. It's very frustrating, and it's one of the reasons why people are like, wait, why didn't you put the Vale before... If we're going in and following the storyline... Right. That's part of the storyline. But again, it's it follows... Because that's the thing. It's Anduin's trajectory through Pandaria is, you know, is fucked. 
by this. Um, it was very, it was like, are you going to do something to kind of at least show that part of the story? Or is this strictly like a leveling exercise, which is fine. But if there's one expansion where people are a little bit bitter about content being completely cut permanently, it's mm -hmm. this one. Yeah. I mean, you're going to go about to go into an entire expansion of where Anduin's kind of deal with shit mm -hmm. and drop this right before it. It's weird. So that's kind of like, I'm hoping that they do something in it to kind of like still show those parts of the story without having to have like the long quest that oh shit this is oh, oh i still need this <laughs> alani will murder us i know no. alani, alani won't murder us alani is, is passive until you use the um the lasso but i don't ah. and i have like a couple i have like a couple spread out amongst characters and you need like five or something ah All right, we are our alliance, so we're going down here. I almost forget how nice the music was in Pandaria. Got it? Got it. Alright. I'm going inside, so I'm gonna dis I'm gonna be dismounted. Yeah. Ah, oh, so pretty in here. You can't learn you can't learn skills. There is a mailbox though, interestingly enough. Uh. Are offering transmog. Not offering void storage though. Just knowing the differences. Yay, your mailbox. Who are you supposed to send mail to? Yeah, good question. I didn't think you could send mail. Um, uh, I mean, it's coming up like I can. I don't know if it actually works. You do actually have bank access. Well, that's good to know because I'm going to I may need that later. There are no portals. But there is bank access. Cool. Hello. Ludwin, who are you? Storage enthusiast? Storage, Storage enthusiast. Time runner's, runner's satchel. satchel. 36 bag. slot bag. Not bad. But I'm full with 36 slot bags. Oh, but if I want one, let's say, for the bank. Yes. But... I don't know. Do I have enough to buy a bank slot? Tell me of your uh, troubles. What? Ten silver, I do. Oh, I do. Okay, then it How gets too expensive. Can I buy? And it to hold. There. <laughs> May the mist there. I feel satisfied that I put a bag, a thirty-six slot bag, in there. <laughs> that made me happy. Storage enthusiast. I love that. He's adorable. Doot, doot, doot. Chamber of Enlightenment. Here is. Please browse my wares. Golden light. Jade Serpent Guide. <laughs> God, I spent so much time in here on uh, on Matori doing the um, cloak runs that I'm like, 
Mm. But it was it was all nozothed out, so I'm like, gank, gank. I'm trying like, not it. I don't know which one you go in if it's this one or the the horde one, but you go in one of them. Mm -hmm. We went to the bank. I was curious to look at the portal room. Just a room of sadness. Yeah, I want to amuse myself. <laughs> That's just cold. It's just a room of sadness. It's just a room of sadness. Portal. 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 <laughs> 41. Jeez Louise. Man, you are booking it. Yeah. Look, there was one to oh, Della right here. Oh, yeah, there was one to Della right Chamber of Reflection. I'm gonna jump off the edge right now. Like, I don't think you can send items in the mail, though. Alright, so... It, if you click on it, it, it pulls up your character list, so... I don't know if I, if I can actually send myself a mail or not, but... She's sitting up here. I'm curious to know if she... I bet she does it horde side, too, so I'm gonna fly over there just to confirm that. Of course. Why is it still playing the music from inside there? I don't know if it's doing that for you or just me. It's very chipper, like polka. That's what it was playing inside the, the yeah. In the other it zone. Stop! But we landed over here. It refused to stop. Don't stare. <laughs> Been in village has gotten. Ooh, Shaw of Anger. Ooh, question we'll pick mark, up... question mark. I got the Shaw of Anger is up. At least the Shaw of Anger only shows up in one spot now. You can just roam the entire place and scare you half the death. Well, yeah, that's what happened. It was. Uh huh. Oh, he's up! Uh, you're... You're a terrifying little thing. Well, not little, but... I'm amazed Wait. no one's trying to kill him yet. It's, and uh... Believe me, it's the only time... It's pretty much he would never see him for this long, ever. Um... No. Um... Y'all, there's a giant shaw of anger nearby. Maybe you should go somewhere. Or at least go inside. Oh, wait, did you get it? Yeah, I got it. Thank you. Like, screw up. So it looks like there's a, um. They, ha they set up shop in each zone, which is good. Mm, makes sense. That's convenient. Hey, Eternus. Hey, huh? Just chillin'. Just redecorating. Uh, Willy nilly like. Mm hmm. Yep. Yeah. Not changing the timeline, just redecorating whole. Thing. Oh, it's so good. I know. It's so good. Whoop. Uh. <laughs> Hmm. 
Gotta visit you on. Of course. Hey, Jarvis. What's up? Fancy seeing you here, my guy. Or person. Sixty-two. No. Question mark. Question mark. Wait. What? Sorry. I'm listening. Hey, Shuan. How you doing? I'll meet you later. Hi. Nothing going on here. Oh, but wait, look who's here already, just standing here. Anduin? Anduin? Anduin, you need to go home. Sunwalker Dresco. Hey, Dresco. Hey, Anduin. There's more to this land than meets the eye. Hey, hey. Go home. <laughs> Your timing couldn't be better. My guy, go home. Be careful. Uh -oh. Like, this is where you... Here. This is... Where you go for the walk into the Vale of the Eternal. But, oh, oh, wait, oh, what? Moving. Oh, no, that's. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Question mark, question that's mark, stuff. guy is doing stuff. Yeah. We're too low level. Oh, uh, yeah, that's why I'm getting up. So that I, so that I am not. We'll be back casualty. there. Oh, a uh, scary murder basement? Okay. Hi, scary murder basement. It's not scary murder basement. One of these, mm. the, it's not in here now, but one of these rooms is um, on the timeless aisle. Uh, Cairo's, Cairo's dormo, um, allows you, gives you, has you collect these things that you use and you use them in certain locations to see possible future events. And in one of these side rooms is where Garrosh is being held. I see. So even though his vision is always cloudy, he can help you see things. No, Kairos, not Nosdormu. Oh, sorry, Kairos. Okay. The one who actually can see things, apparently. Yes. Well, apparently not, but that's just... <laughs> well... Failed know. to see one little... Failed to see... Was a little, was a little bit, little, little. I'm gonna open up an infinite amount of of drawer trainers, drain I'm sure it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Drainai, trainors. What is the plural of drainor? Drainors. I don't know. Drain. <laughs> but up. Uh... Oh goodness gracious! Thank you, folks. I mean, otherwise, you really don't go down here. But that's. Yeah, I don't know that I've ever actually looked down there. I mean, maybe I have. I don't know. It's been a while. I don't think I noticed it until that thing. I don't think there was anything mm. before that. But, uh. I don't know that I had. I don't know that I had to go down there. part of a daily. I mean, it's interesting. And I'm going to assume that part is not going to be in the storyline. Hmm. I mean, if they're cutting out the other stuff, yeah. I mean, probably not then. Yeah. Gerthok is here. Uh, I don't think. Oh, ooh, another one. They're not showing up as quests, though. Mm. Are they showing up as like items of interest? It, there's an achievement for it, but you they they yeah. they usually they used to open up a quest that you turn into Lore, Lore Master Cho, and Veil the right. Eternal Blossoms, and that's not happening. All right, we're gonna go down to here. I probably could fly to the uh, Isle of Giants. I see it. Oh! Let's see if the turtle friend is here. Hey, turtle friend. That makes me sad. Did you get it? Sorry. I got it, thank you. Alright. Oh, you're good.
I forget what the turtle is. Your fatigue. Now, nah, fatigue doesn't scare me. <laughs> okay, a little bit. <laughs> Cause they'll... Uh oh. Um. Um. I'm gonna stand uh, her in the water. I I feel like it's safer in the water. <laughs> Can you mount in the water? <laughs> Hold on. Don't leave me here. I don't have don't the walking on water, me. which is made all the more amusing by the okay. fact that this is the expansion where you get the water walking. Uh... There I is a fly that point. I have a breath bar. I love you. Like I will get this poop. I will get it. You can't. You can't fly on the island. That's part of the problem. Yeah. So since I can't uh, fly, you're gonna need to take the uh, the flight yeah. path. Yeah. Where do you want to go? Um. Let's the go to moment. one keg. Uh, one keg. All right. Cool. Daylight. That's. <laughs> I wonder if people are gonna be doing the undasta and all of that. What? What? Ooh, what the? Yep. Um. Okay. Then it's gone. Okay. All right. Uh. Even the water is pretty. I yeah. Know, I know. I won't do this every time, but. No, it's. I mean, Man. I'm. This is probably the most high res I've viewed Pandaria. Because I'm pretty yes. sure I have my graphics turned way down at this point. Mm. Like, that water did not look like that when I first played the game. Oh, no. They haven't improved it. Just because my. I'm playing on a potato. My computer yeah. has improved. <gasps> Which is like, the view oh. distance kills me. Which is, I'm in a worse spot to look yeah. at view distance. But, but look at that. Yeah, like the if you, is, Yeah, if you ignore the crazy vigor thing that won't go away, bug that won't go away. Um, uh. Yeah, it'll go away when I... Not, <laughs> um, hungry Yeti, get away. Oh, you're ahead of me. Mm -hmm. I left before you did. You know what I really hate about Kun Lai mm. Summit? Hmm. This is the Shaw of Anger again. Shaw of it's, Anger? um. Yeah. The place where you buy. Well, now not anymore since I have the yak, but the place that you buy a lack, yak doesn't have a flight yeah. point. So I can oh. never remember where the hell it was. Good. The yak seller wasn't in one keg. Did they ever? I question him. Yes. Question mark. Question mark. Guy. Do you have soup? You are in for a treat. Make this in your home. Let me try peaches. I can't sell anything. Farewell. Broken dice. Mm -hmm. Or the broken ice. Until next time. Uh, 
I thought this is where that faction was that remained neutral throughout. That they never quite explained. I thought Speak they up. were stationed here. White Tiger, watch over you. All right. Onward. We're not uncovering all of Pandaria. What the hell is that? Is that outside or in my apartment? Uh, that's always a question, isn't it? I'm gonna go. F I don't know if there's a poof up there, but I'm going for the achievement. Not good. Nope. Never run. Oh. There's a thing right here. Oh, someone. Oh, sorry. Ooh, fog of the individual sensory bruise. Someone is fighting. The 32 level void elf is fighting the question mark, question mark, wild serpent. I'm gonna assume someone's on the other side. Because, uh. Yeah, they're gonna die. Oh, maybe not. That is wild. We're level 32. Frozen mountain climber over there. Here's how you're supposed to go up. And then, yeah, there's different sites like this also, statues, mm -hmm. that are part of, um, a quest line. But, uh, I mostly want to go on top of Mount Never Rest. I mean, the there was an achievement. Great. I don't have it, but I did, it, it didn't show up for her, so that's kind of sad. Rude. All right, I'm going to go here. To Shadow Pan Monastery, which is a dungeon. We'll go into Town Long Steps next. So here with the shadow pan mark. Um, and this is where the quest I just got. Um, the achievement I finally got after all these years that I had forgotten about it. And it's Shadow Master. Oh. That's the title. Ooh, how'd you get that? Exactly. I was like, I don't have Shadow Master? And I was like, oh shit, that's right. I never went back and got like the last two things. And it's... It is, um, there were two, one of it, it was doing the dailies, mm -hmm. um, by yourself rather than have, because you could bring one of the shadow pan with you, um, and doing them by yourself. I didn't have, I was missing two of those. And then there was doing them without taking any damage, which is interesting but when you're high enough level, it's easy. But at level, yeah. not so easy. Yeah. So I went in and like just parked Arleia there for a couple of days and just checked every day which quest was there. And I was like, oh, okay, it's there. 
But I do want to pick up the... Oh. Um, I, do I... Are they now showing up as rep? Nope. There's only one Pandaria group showing up with rep, and it's Blackbird. It's. I mean, which I think was just an of... oversight on their part. I mean, to be fair, it does fit though. Like, it would fit if they didn't cut the entire rest of his plot out. Now it's just an anomaly. I mean, it's, it's an anomaly. Yes, that makes sense. I know my ears. Hey, Nozo. Um. Uh, oh, he's got a lot of poofs in his temple. I was mostly looking for where. There they are. Looking for something special? What do you have? Let me browse your goods. Ooh. I still don't have nearly enough, but I do have. Wow, I only have 408 Gold. from flying around <laughs> gathering foods. That doesn't seem to be a lucrative way to earn them. Ah, but here's one. But we are we are getting a level. There'll be another level by the time we're done. Yeah, you're um, ahead of me, actually, but yeah. I don't know how I'm ahead of you if you're following like me. a bubble and a half. Alright, we'll, we'll get it. Don't worry. Alright, do worry. I'll get you there. Did you I'm actually get a head start on me? Not really. Okay. I just got another point, so I'm gonna see what's available for that. Oh, decision times. Evasion. I should do a check, honestly. I know cheat death is one of them, but let me... Actually, let me do that now to be on the safe side since it's right in front of me. Um... I'm not going to worry about a multi. Um, yes, evasion, shadow step. Yep. Yeah. I, I am remembering it correctly. Got it. It's all right. I know which ones to choose. Thank you very much. All right. Onward. Temple of the Setting Sun. Another another dungeon. Is that Temple of the Setting Sun? No, that's Siege of Nuzo Temple. I always liked, aside from those bugs, I always liked this this bridge. This big yeah, fallen bridge tree bridge. Cool. Yeah. It's cool. I always like this. Alright. So I think, aside from Isle of Thunder, which we cannot go to, um, Amber I think. So that'll come in handy. Oh, you went up level? E. Which reminds me, did I get any other mutilate? Nope. Stealth, shadow step, sprint, how about here? What did I get? Uh bell armor. You picked up the spy pit, right? Yes, thank you. I find it really annoying that you have this talent into uh, getting the warlock gates and that you just don't get it. That's really irritating to me. 
Yeah, but so a lot of talents that like that you're going to end up having to take anyway. Like, for I instance, mean, you can't the, get anywhere with the assassin tree unless you take yeah. some of the stuff right on. Like, you have to. Like. I mean, but, for example, like, the warlock gates, like, I was using, like, a, um, a build from, like, wow, not wow, like, like, Icy Veins or something, and it didn't include it, and I'd forgotten that you had talent into it. Oh. And so I was like, oh yeah, I'll just do this. And I was like, oh, wait, nope, I dare change my talent so that I have it. And I just found it out to be really irritating because I feel like it, that's such a class feature that right. it should be a class feature that, that you don't have the talent into. Because that just feels weird and not good. You got that, right? Yes, thank you. Because the other one needs to be opened before you can access it. Um, but I am going to try to pick up the anglers because I'm going to be back here for you, Nat Fagel. You don't remember me? Who doesn't remember me? Ooh. All this the is... time that I spent doing stuff. Ooh. Temple of the Red Crane's got a lot of poofs. Ooh. my mom being convinced that the cats could tell time because roughly at around like, I don't know, 5.30, 6.30, whatever it was, uh, she would go to the pantry and get the cat's treats out. And after a while, because she would do it every day, the cats would be like yowling at the pantry and she's like, uh -huh. you're early. And um, the cats have started getting um, their tube of, I call it cat yogurt. Uh, at night before I go to bed. And after a while, they, they'll start like, hey, hey, where's my gogurt? My cats. By the way. Um, I got them the original stuff, and they go absolutely feral over this shit. It's wild. By the way. Yes. What flavor is that? Uh, the original? The ones that you've been giving them. Um, the other one was chicken. Uh, this one just happens to be like a box I of like you find these to your mixed liking. variety, I think. Yeah. May the red cream. Okay. Not good for poops. Good point. It's weird because I know like I want to there's go one brand that I picked up uh, that I like. Yeah, no, I'm never getting that again because my have really bad poops afterwards. These I'm not really sure about to be honest because I haven't. I've had like this particular brand for like a day maybe or two. So interesting. Any flavor not good for poops or are all of them not good for poops? They tend to be over mushy because of the nature of them. So there's kind of nothing for their insights to grab onto. Yeah, the original, like the Churu or however you say it, it is really runny. The one that I yeah. have been getting them from like Petco or something, it's stiffer. Um, that might but be this better. one is really runny. So, we'll see. I think if I stop giving it to them now, though, they're gonna riot. But, uh, yeah, we'll see how that goes. I, I don't think treats. this this flight point, this is the one I can't open now because you need to undo a thing. Uh-oh. He buys one of us. Oh. Oh no. 
There we go. <laughs> That's exactly what I was expecting to find. Meanwhile, King Bramble Stamp is trying to punch it. <laughs> but yeah, there's a, a Night Elf settlement there that we can't do anything about until we fix it. But... Both of trapped. And then this part is post invasion. So this flight point mm. in the lower east, lower east, this where my I'm heading towards isn't actually there. So I'll be like just going there, but they're not stopping there. not actually physically there. All right, so now we will go to Tavern in the Mists and pick up that one. I've got like a half a, I've got, I'm just racking up the experience for exploration. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm not going for total math completion, but I'm just getting the key flight points at this point. At this yeah. point in the adventure. Why is that weird? Oh. We're not walking up the hundred steps. We're just going to come right here. Yeah. Oh, did, you didn't get it? No, I got it. I got it. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Discover the tavern in the mist. Hey, bud. I will not be able to open you because this quest is done. It is. It's um. What is funny? Well, though he does say Greetings. something. No, I don't know what's inside either. For the alarm. Um. What is funny is if you go here on a character that's completed it, this chest is smashed open. <laughs> it's in pieces. Look, it's Tong! The fixer, poor Tong. Poor suffering Tong. Nothing upstairs. One, oops, one sec. I'm gonna do a quick bio run. Okay.
The battle for Pandaria rages on. Okie dokes. <laughs> so, there's a thing to click over here. A book. And then up here. And upstairs. There's a lockbox you can't open to level 25. <laughs> but I just wanted to point to it. Lockbox. Cool. Let me let me ask who Rathian is. <laughs> These Pandaren question everything. It like, makes you hey, think. Mysterious stranger. Although my title says I am an agent of yours. Who are you? <laughs> Wait, no, let's make this really ridiculous. <laughs> you're putting on the costume? Oh, no, you're bringing up the pet. Ah. The bat's not making it weird. I can fall. Where'd it go? The game say no. Did it? Did it? I. The game's like not on my watch. Now there he is. Okay, here. Go yell things at yourself now for a bit. <laughs> oh, I didn't answer. Hey, left. Hey, right. Wait. Yeah. Okay, left. You are on the left side. Is there such a thing as a righteous war? My knowledge, I am the last of the black dragons. <laughs> Your knowledge is flawed. Oh, hey, Quartermaster. Hmm? Probably ah. ha has nothing. Slow nope. Down. nope. nope. Goodbye. If you had finished the quest line, or at least got further along in it, um, he would have mm -hmm. stuff. Oh. oh, does he have stuff for you? No, not for me. Not oh, on this yeah. character. Um, there is a book back here. Uh, oh. Oh. Mm -mm. Ah. Classic. Yep. Look. <laughs> okay. It's you. And uh, why is it not yelling obnoxious things? <laughs> I think it would be funny if they actually had them interact. I think it would have been funny too, because I mean, they. They knew at some point. I realize there's different teams working on Cataclysm Classic mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and this, but at some mm -hmm. point, someone must have thought, "Gee, we're giving it." Well, it's actually the he's not saying anything now, but um, the lines are for. I know some of them from Cataclysm, but there are definitely ones that are from Pandaria. Mm -hmm. So, so yeah. But it would have been funny, like, wait, what? <laughs> it would have been interesting. <laughs> like, interesting. Wait, what? what? Like, hey, uh, hey, hey, you don't recognize these daggers? <laughs> They're really shiny. You don't recognize them, huh? You don't recognize them, huh? You don't recognize them? Okay. I um, what schnick sound that happens when you unsheathe and resheathe? <laughs> it is satisfying. Yeah. Oh, um, straws. Yep. Interesting. I did was that she that the it, it was a cross straw. Yeah. I mean, it makes sense. Cross straw. I just didn't think about it. Yeah. You have to. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> cross straw. Yeah. I mean. Great. If you if you pull if you you pull them basically under if you 
there's a way. But mm-hmm. um, it would be kind of like, it would be a, an attack from the draw if you do that. And then you have to kind of mm. come in and back with it because they're mm-hmm. upside down. But you can pull and slash. But anyway. Uh, point being, <laughs> missed opportunity <laughs> here, I think. Oh, indeed. Indeed. considering these things were in development or at least if not at exactly the same time close to the same time oh, there yeah. could have been there he goes <laughs> <laughs> but he's, he's saying the nice lines um there what you you don't you don't recognize that I find it weird that if you click on him, he just, like, makes dragon noises at you. So, yeah. He just is like... (laughs) He just hisses at you. He doesn't, like, yell at you or anything. He just hisses. Yeah. He just makes dragon noises. Um, In Cataclysm, he doesn't even have the words. All you could do is click on him. Mm. It's just like... So I'm going to be doing that through Cataclysm too, anyway. But I think I think the uh, I think um, they got rid of the uh, cow murder thing. It looks like from reports, it lo- it says it skipped the pre patch. And what I'm trying ah. to remember, is, and what I don't remember with, is if that quest line was pre-patch, or if it was part of the Twilight Highlands quest mm, that sends you there, because that was a more advanced zone in Cataclysm. So, like you would do, I think your starters were um, Bashir, mm-hmm. um, Mount Hyjal, and Oldham, and I think Twilight Highlands was a little bit more further along. By the time you got there? Because I think most people started in in Hyjal. I started in Vestir almost like half the time. Because Hyjal wasn't really finished either. Because that's where Firelands was. Yes. Whereas Vestir you had... There wasn't a raid. Bashir was bugged though. Like I never, I never finished Bashir because the last quest was bugged for me. I never had, a, I, I heard about that, but I, I was never had a problem with it. Bashir suppo- yeah. was supposed to have a raid, but didn't. I think that was the issue I mean, with I Bashir. Love, like five people that liked Bashir. Uh, I liked Bashir. I liked it. Yeah, I did like it. I was like. Mm-hmm. I had no problem with the, you know, once I had the fast, the fast seahorse mount, I was, I was fine. Oh, yeah. But that's who you have, like, Bud jumps overboard. He also does screwy stuff in Oldham. But yeah. I just remember him on the boat being like, I'm sailing! And then he jumps overboard. It's like, it's, wait, no! Wait, no, that's not what you're supposed to... Okay. Like, of memorable Cataclysm moments, that's one of them. Um, and then you meet the giant squid that you have to fight in the dungeon later on. Giant squids! <laughs> Hi, person! Don't mind me. I was like, oh man, <laughs> question mark, question mark, but I realized I'm level 14. Question mark, question mark can be like 45. So, yeah. There's nothing to do in this inn. Um... Except I mean, look at a dead quest. Around. They might be doing what I'm doing. Like, I'm going to exactly. go here to invest. They did pause in front of me. Like, wait. <laughs> yeah. Huh? We both know why we're here. Um, oh, wait. I want to make sure. That I have two whelps following me now. One of them is you. I wanted to find... Here we go. The black... Which has moved on, but... What do you need? 
Free tired exchange Enough program. Madam Zora is set up in uh, Dragonflight though now. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now. Um, I will go back to... I'm just trying to see if I can... Ah. Water. I know those birds attack, so I'm I'm like avoiding yeah. them. I don't think I opened up this flight point. Yeah, those birds were the bane of my existence when I was leveling through here on foot. Oh, I remember those birds very well. Bane of my existence. Oh, did at I some point this weekend. Hmm? I was like, did I lose Rathius? I think I did. I think you did, yeah. Uh, yeah Couldn't keep up. <laughs> bad. Nah, he has little flappy wings. Uh, at some point this weekend, I'm going to bend your ear about, uh, students' projects. That's fair. So, well, I am gonna turn these- I am gonna turn these quests in. Oh, Finally. Because yeah. I think my, I get a hat piece, and I want my hat piece. We are outnumbered. If it is war you mean to bring to our shores, the very land itself will respond to your passion. And your violence. I do not know what the ultimate consequences will be. Nobody does. I'm sorry, Terenzu. Greetings, Wanderer. Uh. Next one is on me. I'll accept your there quest no tomorrow, way. but right now I want to open up my goodies and put my goodies on. Oh. So I have Roll, which uh, is... Snacks and Scrolls has a quest for us. Pete, Pete, Pete. Norwin. What? Ah, Norwin has a quest... Sorry, Nostwin has a quest for us. Okay, I'll be there soon. I'm looking at- I have roll? Do I need- What am I gonna- It's a cogwheel jam. Roll is- would be fun, but I don't- I'll hold on to it. Alright. Hey, I don't- to... Oh, I got Garrett! Oh! Yes! Thank you! The... Thank you! Oh! All right. So I have this questing add-on that just kind of, and so it's an upgrade. Fifty-six thousand one hundred percent. I'm like, I don't think that's possible, but thank you. Ooh. I have a and macro for next. that. Wow, I got just got a bunch of skills. All right, hold on. Oh, lockpick does not go there. That is a waste. That is a waste of of something of a of a button slot. Hold on. You. Do I have a tinker socket? Up here. Um. No, I think it. That's okay. put that up here. Um, cheap shot carrot. Ooh, heroic leaf. I mean, I don't know that I need to be doing heroic leaf. Is that a dagger? Uh, 
pocket. Where is Snacks? There it is. Alright, I think I did that. So that's good. Slowly but surely we're getting there. Do I pick a, have I picked a specialization? Not yet. Oh no, I can. I'll say assassination for now. Alright, so we have Mishka. Everyone's got quests. Let's see with, um, no! I did not want to go there. <laughs> I was trying to click on you, little guy. Bizarre, isn't it? Got any bronze? Come spend it at my bazaar. This will get you there. First one's free. I just bought a bunch of those. I guess that's like if you didn't know about it already, but it's fine. All right, so let me deal with my gear. That's a freebie. Slay, Ooh, Tinker Gem. High level of eight. When you attack an enemy below ten percent, you will attempt to slay them, inflicting shadow damage equal to one hundred percent of your maximum health. You'll only attempt to slay an enemy once. Fits in a Tinker Zone. Sounds good to me. I'm an assassin. I guess it's removed with patch 11.0. Oh, yes. Thank you very much. Um, so let me. Ghost Fox Bindings. I didn't have any before. Um, Ghost Fox Grips. I now got gloves. And Ghost Fox Foot Guards. I now got new feet. See, I'm glad I didn't. Glad I didn't uh, suck at those before. Save me a step. But let's see, what can I do now? So grips take tinker slots. What have I got for tinker? We'll do the sleigh there. Slay in my pan seems great. Play. Ah. I don't think I want. Oh, that's Cogwheel Gem. I don't see me using that really. I'll put things I don't know what I'm going to do in there with. Timeless Scroll of Intellect infuses a target with brilliance, increasing their intellect by. Well, that doesn't serve me. I'm a rogue. Alright, um, Windweaver, Tinker Gem, it, your movement speed is increased by 5% and you have immunity to falling damage. Your abilities have a chance to increase your party's haste for death. Okay. This is also a Tinker slot, so this will go in here. I need a headpiece, damn it. Bad light. So I can put my granny glasses on. But I will deal with that tomorrow because I do need to go to sleep. So I can work on an email some more. I have many lucky dudes. Why am you I doing like? this? It's not how uh, one well, does this. Friend of the Grummels. It's not how this game works. boots in there. Alrighty. 
Okay then. I am going to sleep. But I will stay here. I will park her butt down here. And hopefully tomorrow she'll start working some of these other quests. Move her further along. And we'll see. I don't know. I'm not streaming tomorrow, though. Do I only want to do this on the stream? No, I want to move further along. Um, if I uncover any big plot points they maintain, I will deal with it then. Alright. I am saying goodnight. And tomorrow we will have some proper granny glasses. So help me. Good night. <laughs>